Well, a volunteer who travels to the third world to offer dental and vision services is leading the fight in Rhode Island to drive out illegal immigrants. He recently returned from Nicaragua and spoke today with political Rappley, political reporter Bill Rappley, who joins us now. Bill, does he see any conflict in being the humanitarian and also fighting the fight against immigration? Well, that's uh, what we asked him about, Nicole. And State Representative Peter Palumbo is the volunteer, says no, there is no conflict. He says he understands more than most people why folks want so badly to come to America, but he says they need to stay home to make their own countries better. Every year for the last 20 years, NIVASH, the Northeast Volunteer Optometric Services to Humanity, has run midwinter clinics in Nicaraguan schools. Last month, nearly 3,500 patients received services. There are hundreds of people waiting. He and his colleagues fix teeth. Others perform cataract surgery and hand out glasses, and it's rewarding enough that most doctors return year after year. You feel so good doing it. I mean, you're giving it back. You know, we're blessed in this country, and, and we have all these things. And, and, and you go over there, and they have they don't have anything like the grandmother living in a house near one of the schools when I say a house it was basically a wooden frame with plastic bags to keep the rain out and when the volunteers brought a wheelchair to the woman who could not walk showing her how it worked and the kids wheeling her around mm -hmm. and this woman the tears running down her face mm -hmm. pretty special State Representative Peter Palumbo's there in the tank top, and he's been on many of these trips and knows why many Nicaraguans see America as an opportunity, but he will not offer them a pass. These people can't come here in the numbers that they're coming here, and we can't, they can't assimilate properly. We're going we're gonna to sink. The ship's going to sink. We can't afford to do it anymore. So he'll keep fighting for laws to drive illegal immigrants out of his state while continuing to try to help them in their own countries. By us going over there, we show the other side of America that we're not just the ugly Americans, we're there to help them. Now, Palumbo's been on these types of humanitarian trips for years, first in Bosnia, then these recent trips to Nicaragua. But it does not deter him from trying to write laws that will make it impossible for immigrants without papers to live here. Some opponents of those laws claim they are thin bales for racist attitudes, but Palumbo says he's no racist and he wouldn't accept anybody coming into this country illegally. I'm Bill Rapley, NBC 10 News. Thank you. At very the much. desk with Nicole. I love it. Interesting story, though. Thanks, yeah. Bill.